Hi everybody, in this video I'm going to talk about this miniature muscle figure I just finished painting. Uh, this is my first uh, art project I finished this year. Uh, well, I did some other things, but this is an actual art art thing, I guess. Uh, this is a little muscle figure. His number is um, 194 if you're interested. I found out his name is Hawana Satan or Hiawa Satan. I can't really pronounce it. But the first word, it seems like it represents... Uh, they're kind of like funeral statues in Japan, or I'm not quite sure. It's a little hard to find things out about these. I really wish these figures had uh, like numbers on them because there's only one uh, like image of the of a visual checklist, so it's really kind of difficult. There's an other site that's really nice, uh, but uh, you have to pay or sign up for something like that, and uh, yeah, that's it's kind of ridiculous. Uh, but this guy was pretty fun. I got to a point where I just wanted to stop because, uh, I don't know, I just got to move on. But I think I'm at a good place where I'm kind of happy how it turned out. And uh, we'll talk a little bit about it. First, I thought he he kind of looks like he has an onion on his head up top. <laughs> so I kind of went with that theme. I guess he's kind of alien too. So I kind of went like a bug alien theme. Uh... I did a pretty good job. On the head, I did some, a little bit of shading. It, it's more apparent on the, the back of the figure. And uh, I like how I did it. Um, I, there wasn't too many grooves to paint, so uh, it was nice. Th I think this is what I gotta start doing, is just kinda doing subtle things and then eventually get more complicated until I get better at it. Um, his eyes have a little slit in there, and uh, really, I should go back with some wash and kind of fill that out. But uh, I don't know. <laughs> uh, but I uh, might might do that one day. Also, some other little things you gotta fix are I wanted to paint little silver beads on his. Um, he's got like ribbing around his neck there. Um, but uh, I don't know. Part of me kind of likes how it's it, the the different colors because. It, like if it's just one piece or not. And what I did was uh, for his undersuit, it's kind of like this pavement gray. And uh, I liked it, but I just wanted it a little bit different. So I, I took some silver glitter paint glue stuff. And that's what all the little wet white speckles are. And uh, it looks kind of funny on the, on the picture. But uh, in real life, it, it looks pretty neat. It gives a little something extra. And uh, for the shading and blending, I did a little bit on his waist and uh, some on his hands too. Uh, by his feet, I didn't do as nice job, but uh, it still looks okay, I think. Um, what I started doing was kind of putting some washes in. So I put like a, a black wash and a red wash. And actually, it, it kind of gets the effect of shading, or what I wanted out of it. Um, so, I'm, I'm happy with it. There's a little parts that could be touched up, and here or there. But it's not as rough as some of my other other ones are. And uh, in the picture, you can see all these little glaring details, because the picture's really big. But these aren't really that big, so... Uh, I was happy how it turned out. I thought it was pretty cool. I don't know if I'm going to put him on a base or anything. He, he's kind of w a little weird, but um, let me know what you guys think about it. And if you have any of these, uh, let me know. And I'll do another video. I got some of these other ones completed. And uh, this one, I start doing some of these uh, wrap up videos. I'm going to do it like this through the pictures because uh, it's a lot better quality than my camera. And. Uh, yeah, I hope you guys like it, and I'll keep doing some more.